It's really special. It's really special to have it here. There's only one place in the continent that you're going to have something like this. And so for me, like, when I'm working here, it's, it's nice because I see people from all around the world just come just to visit. You know, people who are Baha'is, people who aren't Baha'is. You know, they come through and they ask questions and we talk. And a lot of uh, Baha'is, if they're traveling from other parts of the world, if, they're gonna, if they come anywhere near Chicago, they're going to go to the temple, you know. So it's definitely nice to see people experience coming here because it is a very special place. I would never come to Wilmette if it weren't for the House of Worship. And for that reason, it's actually kind of special because it's like, it's a different, it's a different universe almost. It's just so removed from my life. For those of us who work here, who live here, we probably take it for granted a little bit, you know, because you know, I come here every day, so it's like, what's the big deal? But at the same time, you know, when you see other people experiencing uh, it for the first time, it's really special. So I get a lot of my enjoyment by talking to people and you know sharing with them their experience of coming here. I actually served at uh, the Baha'i House of Worship in New Delhi in India, and I, although like Baha'is came there, really the focus of our service was telling other people about the Baha'i faith and kind of giving them an opportunity to say prayers with people of all different religions. I really just came because I'd never seen it before. And I just heard that the building was like amazing, like really beautiful. And also, I mean, I really don't know anything about Baha'i beliefs, so I figured we'd come in and kind of check it out. Early 1900s, there were very few Baha'is in the United States at all. In a lot of ways, the building of the temple also helped to build the community. You know, it was their first major endeavor. It's interesting. Sometimes it actually feels like, even though it's very special to me, it's really more for other people. It's for people who haven't learned about the Baha'i faith yet. So it's special to me, but it doesn't, doesn't even feel like it's necessarily for me.